Good afternoon, student. Today we are going to do the question from exercise thirteen point four, uh, sorry thirteen point two, question number four. The diameter of a roller is eighty four centimeter and its length is one twenty centimeter. It takes five hundred complete revolution to move once over once over to uh, level a playground. Find the area of the playground in meter square. Now the roller is having the diameter eighty four centimeter, so radius will become. 84 upon 2 cm that is 42 cm if you calculate uh, convert in meter square meter because we have to find the area of playground in meter square so we have to convert this in meter so 42 upon 100 meter that will be 0.42 meter and uh, its length is 120 cm that means it is having the height that is equals to 120 cm this also will convert in meter 120 upon 100 this will cancel 1.2 meter so now it in the question it takes 500 complete revolution now in one revolution let's say this is a shape of the cylindrical roller and when it will rolls uh, once it is covering its curved surface area so first we'll find the curved surface area of Cylind uh, cylindrical uh, roller curved surface area of cylindrical roller and the formula we know it is two pi r h that is two into twenty two upon seven into r radius is zero point four two meter into Height that is one point two meter. So when we cancel this, this becomes zero point zero point zero six. So when we multiply this two into twenty two into zero point zero six into one point two, we'll get answer three point one six eight meter square. Now we have to find the area of playground. So how many times it is taking revolution? Five hundred complete revolution. So Area of playground will be equals to five hundred into curved surface area of the cylindrical roller. And what is curved surface area of cylindrical roller? That is three point one three point one six eight meter square. So when we multiply this, we'll get the answer one five eight four meter square. So the Area of the playground in meter square is one thousand five hundred and eighty-four meter square. Now let us solve the question number fifth of exercise number thirteen point two. A cylindrical pillar is fifty centimeter in diameter and three point five meter in height. Find the cost of painting the curved surface area of the pillar at the rate of rupees twelve point five zero per meter square. Now let us consider this as a pillar. So we have to paint. That is the we have to paint this side, this part of this. That is we we have to paint the outer curved surface area. And let us see what is given in the question. Diameter is fifty centimeters, so radius will become fifty upon two. That is equals to twenty five centimeter. We will convert in meter by dividing it by hundred. So twenty five upon hundred that is zero point two five meter. And height is given that is. 3.5 3.5 meter now let us find first the curved surface area curved surface area area of cylindrical pillar and that is equals to the formula is 2 pi r h 2 into 22 upon 7 R is zero point two five meter and height is three point five meter. So when we we'll cancel this, this will become zero point five. Zero point five. Now let us solve this. Two into twenty two into zero point two five into zero point five. When we we'll multiply, we'll get the answer that is equals to five point five meter square. Now we have to find the cost of painting. Now, in the question, it is given that cost of painting one meter square is rupees twelve point is rupees twelve point 
0.50 so we have to find the cost of painting the area that we have got that is the curved surface area and that is 5.5 meter square 5.5 meter square so that will be equals to rupees 12.50 12.50 into 5.5 so when we we'll multiply this we'll get the answer that is equals to 68.75 so 68.75 rupees are required to the paint the pillar which is having the diameter of 50 cm and height 3.5 m now let us solve the question number 6 of exercise 13.2 curved surface area of a right circular cylinder is 4.4 m square if the radius of the base of the cylinder is 0.7 m find its height now in this question it is given that the curved surface area of right circular cylinder is 4.4 cm square now that is given that is curved surface area of cylinder curved surface area of cylinder and that is equals to what 4.4 m square and you know the formula of curved surface area of cylinder that is 2 pi r h is equals to 4.4 now 2 into 22 upon 7 into radius radius is 0.7 m 0.7 meter is equals into h. H we have to calculate is equals to 4.4. Now when we cancel this, set so, uh, 0.7 divided by 0.7 divided by 7 that will become 0.1. So 2 into 22.22 .22 into 0.1 that is 4.4 into h is equals to 4.4. So h will be equals to 4.4 divided by 4.4, so h will be equals to 1 meter. So the height of the cylinder is 1 meter.